Hi guys. Thanks. I just screwed up the introduction. Let's try again. <laughs> Hey, guess what? It's unboxing day. We get to find out what's in these boxes here. Okay. Okay, we'll get started. I already cut this one open. And that's about all I did to it. So we'll go ahead and open this. I'll show you what's in these. I guess you can see already what's in this. Oh boy. Nice wheel. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> it's got a nice packaging on it. It's got this nice protective sleeve. It's got this nice little, it's like a bonnet or something. Just put it in your head or something. I don't know, it protect your hair from painting, right? Okay, enough of that. Uh, woo -hoo. Nice. These are uh, wheels actually from Jags. Whoop, there we go. Okay, there we go. That looked nice. Got a matching front and back, so everything matches now. Uh, these are the Jags SSR. Uh, what is it? Yeah, SSR star with the gloss black. So that means I can put it up there. That's the type of wheel I got. Um, so not a bad looking wheel. I wanted something to match the car and stuff. The ones on there, they're getting old. I had had those for gosh, 11, 12, 13 years. So anyway, I th thought something for a change. I thought that'd be a good way to dress up the car. Take a look in the the back ones. Okay. Okay, look at that. sleeve, nice little bonnet for the head. Okay, voila, looks just like the front. So these are actually 15 by 8s. What's on the car is 15 by 10s. So yeah, I'm going a little bit narrower on the wheel, same size tire. So I don't think we're going to have any issues with it. Uh, different backspacing of course between the front or what's on there now. I have 15 by 10s on the back now, these 15 by 8s. A little back, different spacings, but I'll shove it up there and see what it looks like here in a second. So, in fact, let's go ahead and do that now. Okay. Go ahead and just keep that off for now. I'll scratch that up. Take a look at it here. Oops. What do you think? I think it's gonna look nice. I think it's gonna look pretty nice. Probably don't have to run the spacer in it anymore. That was for the 15 by 10s. It got really close back here. So uh, I ran just a little uh, quarter inch spacer on it. But with these 15 by 8s, I think I can be able to tuck it in a little bit more, set it deeper in. Yeah, plenty of clearance on the on the calipers. 
already ground on these calipers once to get the other wheels to fit so I knew they were not going to have any issues with it. We did a lot, a lot of grinding in here and a little bit here on the back side, but mainly up here to clear the inside of it. So, but yeah, take that off. So, put it back up there. Let's see if it looks one more time. Yep. Yeah, these are 15 by 8s, 5.5 offset. So, uh,. I think they can look pretty good. That'll work. So, got one more box on box, and I'll show you what's in that. Okay, the rectangular box. I wonder what can be in this one. Hopefully, you can see what's doing here. Now I feel really stupid. So, ouch. I'm going to go ahead and lift it up here. It's got a nice little handle on it. Here we go. One. Two, three. Uh, oh, yes, it's a heavy box. <sighs> it's like Christmas around here at Ken's Corner. That's right, cylinder heads. I'm going to take one of these out of the box here and show you what it looks like. I think it'd be impressive. Um, let's get let's get started. Okay, here we go. Let's get this out. Let's get this out of here. See what it looks like. What do you think? Okay. The packaging is unbelievable. Okay, new Ellis head from uh, Texas Speed. It's one of their PRC heads, okay? It's their 15 degree, uh, 220cc heads. Um, Black Friday, what can you say? Man, they're running a good special on these. Uh, these are as cast, they're not CNC port, any of that stuff. But let me tell you what, for a casting and how smooth these things are inside, it's amazing. So it's not like a normal head would be or something like that where the casting's pretty rough. These castings are pretty, pretty nice for not being CNC'd. Uh, chambers, what we did with on this one, we actually had them shaved it down 20,000. So these are actually 62 uh, chambers, CC chambers, instead of 64, that's what they, the stock ones are at. So valves are much larger. These are 2.045 intakes, 1.60 uh, exhaust. Um, these are cathedral port heads, as you can tell here, okay, so they're all cathedral port, it looks pretty nice, uh, probably what you don't see is springs, okay, there's no springs on these, they did go ahead and put the valve seals on them for me, which is good, um, what we're going to go ahead and do, I'm going to take the springs off my other head, I'm going to put it on here. I only have one season on those, on those springs, and those springs should last a while. So anyway, uh, I'm going to take those springs off, put this, those springs on from that head, on those heads to this head, and call it good. So those springs just still should be good. So that's the reason why I didn't get another set of springs. But those other heads, I'm going to sell them. So they're going to be sold like they are without springs. They're 243 heads, so I expect to see that coming up on Marketplace here really soon. So uh, anyway... Uh, Really nice heads, like I said, Black Friday, really good deal. I think it's a couple hundred dollars off. So, but, uh, so hopefully this should pick up the car a little bit quicker. So, won't know until we get all this stuff swapped out, but that's what I'm hoping. So, uh, hope you enjoyed this unboxing. Uh, can't show you what it's going to look like on the head, but, or the head on the motor, not quite there yet, but expect that video to come out real soon. So, I like how they put the engraving on the end here, PRC. Let you know that hey, you got a, a really good head on the car. So, uh, but uh, other than that, I'm pleased with all the stuff I got for the Black Friday stuff. Uh, really good deals on this stuff. So, uh, if you have any questions about any of the products that I should or that you see here that I unboxed, please leave a comment down the section. I'd be more than happy to talk to you about those and stuff. 
any of the part numbers, any of that good stuff, I'll try post on the comment section as well or down in the description so you can know exactly what I got and all that good stuff. But uh, with that, uh, thanks for watching my channel and expect some of these other videos coming out really soon of all my other projects. But I just want to give you a quick little update on some of the new stuff, new tools we're getting. Oh, one other thing we did get in. Um, expect to come real soon. Tensure or the tire pressure monitoring system. Expect to see that uh, project coming up here real soon. But we did get, get this in as well. So expect another quick little video about this one coming out real soon. So anyway, so with that, uh, I do appreciate it. But if you like what you see, hit that like button and hit that subscribe, bu bu uh, su subscribe button there on my channel. So until then, until the next time, see you later. Yes, I did stop.